Hello, this is Trent Smith with the National Weather Service of Missoula, Montana, doing the planning briefing for Sunday, February 25th. Looking at the weather threat matrix, the Northern Rockies are going to be under an extremely active weather pattern uh, for the next five to seven days with a pretty strong cold front coming through Monday and then another one anticipated for the Thursday time frame. So right here is just a uh, rundown of the uh, uh, model depiction of the reflectivity or what our radar will look like over the next uh, 24 to 36 hours. So I'll just let this kind of run through showing uh, the shower developing across northwest Montana this afternoon and evening on Sunday and then the front really kind of pushing through Sunday night uh, producing a pretty strong band over uh, southwest Montana down into Lemhi County by early morning hours. And then showers will redevelop during the afternoon, maybe even getting a few snow bands uh, across the area. So if you want to watch this again, uh, just uh, rewind the video and uh, look through it. So kind of the expected snowfall with this uh, first event. Uh, this is kind of uh, Sunday during the day, ending at 5 a.m. on Tuesday. We are looking at several inches to uh, probably a couple of feet in the mountains. Uh, the valleys will start off as rain, then transition over to snow. And during that transition period, uh, the precipitation should uh, taper down. There could be some areas with locally higher amounts, especially across southwest Montana and Lamai County, just due to that snow band uh, that develops. But again, a very vi rigorous uh, system, bringing plenty of precipitation, but a lot of snow and wind to uh, the area. So kind of the low end and the high end amounts uh, with this system are being projected here. The low end, at least this amount of snow uh, being anticipated. But again, kind of the higher end amounts on the right hand side of the screen. Uh, as this front comes through, we are looking at some really strong winds. So this is the wind probability of 40 miles per hour and 50 miles per hour uh, ending at 11 p.m. on Sunday. So predominantly a 24 hour period. Uh, as you can see, a widespread uh, 60 to 90 to 100 percent of uh, wind gusts of 40 miles per hour. And then uh, the 15 miles per hour is the image to the right uh, projecting. And then on Monday, uh, this will be predominantly during the Monday morning hours is when we're anticipating these stronger winds uh, as that focus shifts more into uh, north central Idaho, southwest Montana, and Lemhi County uh, as that front moves through. So kind of probabilities of the 40 to 50 mile per hour uh, once again. So looking at the temperature trend, again, it's going to be a fairly strong cold front that comes through. So our highs have been running about 10, 15 degrees above normal, or temperatures actually. Um, by Monday time frame, they'll get knocked down to more seasonal readings. And then on Tuesday, we're actually looking at a little bit of an Arctic air mass, trying to get over the divide, uh, predominantly affecting northwest Montana and maybe down into the Butte just on the other side. Um, but that's going to be fairly short-lived uh, as we uh, start getting back into a, a warm southwest flow by the Thursday time frame and then another cool down Saturday, Sunday with another potential uh, of an Arctic trying to get into northwest Montana. So uh, with that Arctic air on Tuesday, um, especially across Glacier Park and up into the Kalispell, uh, there is the potential over a flash freeze of roadways and then some enhancement of snow at Marias Pass uh, during that time frame. So uh, like I was saying, there is going to be another cold front that's going to be coming in. We're looking at some really good moisture streaming across northwest Montana starting Wednesday, Wednesday night. And as that front moves through Thursday, all that precip is going to move southward. And then it's going to kind of hang up around uh, Lem High, southwest Montana, north central Idaho. Uh, Thursday, Friday time frame. So this is kind of the projected 72 hour snowfall totals um, out there for that uh, Wednesday through Friday uh, ending at 5 a.m. Saturday morning. And again, we're looking at probably a couple more feet of snow in the mountains. Uh, once again, the system's going to start off fairly warm. So uh, the valleys will uh, have rain and then transition over to snow uh, after the frontal passage on Thursday. Uh, that front 
uh, we'll bring uh, gusty winds. This time at the main focus is going to be kind of more across Lemhi and southwest Montana. Uh, again, this is the probability of gusts greater than 40 miles per hour. And this is predominantly on the Thursday time frame appears to be when the strongest winds are going to occur. So another breezy, uh, snowy kind of event um, uh, for the northern Rockies. So the next several slides are just uh, select uh, mountain passes, uh, giving the timing of snow amounts uh, in six hour increments along with the, the temperature. I'll go through the remainder of these slides fairly quickly, uh, but if you wanna look at one, just stop uh, the video on it. So looking at the six to 10 day outlook, uh, again, the, the region will stay under a fairly active pattern. The trough kind of being right along the western coast uh, will probably be in kind of a southwesterly flow. Uh, but again, there is a probability the temperatures will be cooler than normal um, during this time frame, with a, a fairly decent chance of above normal precipitation. Uh, so once again, we're looking at a very strong cold front moving through Sunday night, Monday, uh, Arctic going into Northwest Montana, Monday night into Tuesday morning, and then we'll have another front affecting the area Wednesday night through Friday. Uh, if you have any questions about the upcoming uh, weather, please feel free to give us a call at the number on the screen. Uh, and if you wanna be notified of the latest video, uh, please uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank you, goodbye.